Welcome to our lesson about the move and copy command. Let's start by activating the command. We'll go to insert, features, move slash copy. Let's scroll down the property manager. Click translate rotate. First thing to do is select the bodies to move and copy. We can opt to copy by checking here. And then we enter the number of copies down below. We can grab and drag the green arrow to position. Alternatively, we can specify the delta value right here. I'll leave my positioning as is and then click OK. Now let's go back to Insert, Features, Move slash Copy. Now let's click on Constraints. And we select the bodies to move. Let's apply mates. This face, this face here, add, OK. Again, let's activate the tool Insert Features, Move Copy. Select our bodies to move. I'll select these four structural members. And now let's apply mates. We'll select this face and this face here. Offset, enter a distance. Let's flip the direction and click OK. As you can see, the Move Copy tool makes it much easier to build a more complex part. This concludes our lesson about the Move Copy command.